Hello everyone, welcome again and uh, today I am going to continue my Android tutorial. In the first tutorial, uh, we will be seen the, how to add uh, JDK and how to download and install the JDK. This is the first requirement for Android application development. And the second one is uh, you need to Eclipse. So I am going to show you how to download Eclipse and uh, run it and uh, how to add uh, the edit and sdk and eclipse so first you need the eclipse so go on your google and uh, here open your google page and type here eclipse for android okay here you can see the first link uh, Eclipse only Eclipse okay here the, the official website of Eclipse eclipse.org click here and download okay now you can select the platform first Windows Linux or Mac and all and the second option if you choose the window there is a again two option uh, 32 bit or 64 bit suppose uh, you are using the 64 bit hit on this button Hit on this link and uh, then click on download. Then, uh, when you get the uh, downloading, is uh, going to be start. So, but I don't want to download it because I have already. So I j I just want to show you how to download. And after the downloading, you get uh, this uh, RAR file and after the now you need to extract here when you click on extract here you get this folder eclipse just open it there is a no need to install the eclipse only just double click on icon and it's going to be run when you run it the first time it asks about the workspace like this and uh, select uh, where you want to store your applications and your Android applications and if you don't want it message uh, this message again this box again so click on this checkbox and click on ok, okay. now Eclipse is going to be launched ok now you no need to be SDK and EDD so first uh, I am going to show you how to download the SDK package so go on Google and type simply SDK for Eclipse when you type this you get the first link Android Studio and SDK tools developers.android.com slash SDK when you open this uh, you get this Android Studio this is the latest ID for uh, Android development but we are using to Eclipse so click on install the SDK because we want alone alone SDK so here there is a two option first SDK with Android Studio and the second one is stand alone SDK so we want uh, alone so click on alone and read all the instruction carefully and uh, click on download the SDK now and here Here we want SDK only, so click on uh, this and accept all the conditions. So click on download. Now the SDK installer is uh, going to be download, but I don't want to download it. It's, uh, the first thing, read all the instruction carefully because there is all the process about the SDK. Uh, okay now the next thing is uh, after the downloading SDK you go on your uh, Eclipse and uh, you need to an edit plugin so how to download the edit plugins and Eclipse 
so go on help and install new software and click on it and here Edity, um, you just go on Google and type edit for Eclipse and uh, open this second link developer.android.com uh, slash sdk slot installation slash uh, installing edit.html when you open it here all the instruction about uh, read it uh, carefully uh, because here all the instruction about the download the edit and set path of sdk so here you can uh, read go and help and install new software and click on add button which is the top corner and here this one and uh, as a enter as a name as a edit plugin so i'm going to just copy paste so copy it from edit plugins and copy it as a link here is a link so just copy it and paste it here and click on ok and here select the developer option click on next your uh, edit is going to be download but i don't want to download uh, because i have already so i'm going to cancel it and uh, you download after the downloading you go on windows and friends you get this android option here because it's uh, enable after the downloading the edit and select ed uh, android where you can see the add location of sdk uh, remember the path when you install the sdk and the download and store the sdk because uh, this path is needs here so my sdk and c drive and user full and user and oops and android sdk okay. if you your uh, the default uh, path is uh, in your uh, username but if you want uh, add uh, it uh, on another location so set the path from here go and browse and select the path okay, okay. now your editor is ready to develop an android application okay thank you so much for watching and uh, if you like plus subscribe me and uh, one more thing here uh, before the installing uh, and uh, creating the setup firstly read this all the instruction very carefully because there is a, all the all the instruction about the installation uh, process and uh, it is open source so freely available and thank you so much for watching next video we uh, next uh, tutorial we are going to we create our first application. Thank you so much for watching.